back of Kenny Omega. Matt Jackson's lower. champions that triangle has a chance to put it to put, put everything to rest here tonight with a victory yeah i don't think anyone expected uh, that this would be a three to one deal right now that death triangle would have that advantage over the elite so that happened once in recent memory 2016 lebron james led the cleveland cavaliers to defeat the golden state warriors to come back and win the nba finals that is the type of performance the elite will need to have here tonight if they hope to come back in this series against death triangle don Callis, thank you for joining us here at the desk big game plan tonight we're all about game planning big big match tonight we've got to win this Whoa. Death Triangle taking flight and taking out the Elite on the outside. Now here's the question. How is Nick Jackson doing? How's the injury? Nick's fantastic. He's okay. got freakish recuperative powers, Shivani. Freakish recuperative powers. Yep. So with Nick's offense, you know, that we'll see how that ankle works and how it's feeling. So right now, Death Triangle's all over. Said Nick Jackson. Oh, Nick escapes out of the quarter. Penta found nobody home. You see... Nick Jackson was hobbling a little bit there. He was. Yeah, you can see already he is. So Matt Jackson and Kenny Omega follows it up. Penta getting singled out. Oh, and Nakasawa. It's no disqualification. That's right. What the heck? What? There's an elf. There's an elf in the ring. What the hell? What? There's two elves. Okay. I'm begging you, Bob. The Colts ran to the eyes of Alex Abrahantes. And oh! Watch out. Nick Jackson oh. missile drop kick from Ray Phoenix. I still like this aggressive start by the elite. Game plan. It's all about game plan, Shivani. You are you're a master at game planning, Don Callis. Oh, Among other things. Oh, 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 oh. The oh. trash can. Kenny Omega didn't see it coming. He turned and right there, Penta met him with the trash can on the head. Again, no disqualification, weapons, anything. People running, whatever. It's all, all go, man. It's all good to go, I should say. Watch out. Yeah, big oh. I think it was a great move making this no disqualification because you know they were going to use the hammer anyway. That oh. been the rim up. I almost said something bad, but I'll stop. Yeah. <laughs> There's the first time for everything. <laughs> His elbow strike. Ray Fenix, yeah, just raining down elbow strikes on Matt Jackson. And it is no disqualification. Death Triangle can close it out. They can end this series look, here tonight look, look, in San Antonio. Look, Nick, man, I'm telling you, he's hurting. Don, like it or not, man, you can see the man is hurting. That ankle is not 100%. Well, what's going on so far, it's no wonder all of them aren't hurting, Taz. I mean, this is brutal, and yeah. we're only a couple minutes in. Ray Fenix goes between the legs of Nick Jackson. eats the kick on the outside. Pack. Once again, on that injured face, that badly broken nose. Stuck the landing. Nick Jackson look out, stuck with the sling blade by Penta. And our opening contest, match five in the best of seven series, continues in picture in picture. <laughs> well, Penta now. Oh, wow. Into the unforgiving needles of the artificial pine tree. Yeah, that tree is just bent in half. Oh, there goes Nick. Pine needles, and now Matt Jackson goes as well. 
unforgiving artificial pine needles. Oh, Matt God. slides. He avoids oh, the chair. Oh. Big high cross body from Nick Jackson. Huge high cross body. Again, this is no disqual. Or to retain the, the AEW World Trios champions. Oh, no. 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 Bad ankle. Oh, that's really bad. And Pac is going to yeah. dissect it. That's right. A little overzealous by Nick that time. You're right. Play Uh-oh. here tonight in match five. And they're going to break it. They're going to have to break it off. That. They're going to yeah. shatter that ankle. And Kenny's trying to get up. Trying to get in the way. He got there. He just he flung that, that trap. Matt Jackson takes up the Lucha Brothers on the outside. Great momentum shift here. Started by Kenny Omega with a trash can. I have no idea what he's going to try to do with that trash can on the ring post. Whatever it is, it's going to hurt. No, I've got a pretty big idea. It's going to hurt a lot. Kenny's going to not only hike up the green overalls, he's going to put the trash can on his head. Kenny Omega. Oh, wait, no, he's not going to channel Great Sasuke. Instead, the moves up with the trash can. Pay for it. Down the hole. Oh, oh it's stuck to his tights. Oh, no. Now, ah, across the back of Ray Fennick. Oh, wait, Kenny. Now. Look oh, out. Oh, Fennick's face first into the barbed wire on the probe. Clean it up, all right. Bent up over the top. It lands on the apron. Matt Jackson follows up with the right hand. Pack sent over the top as well. Physical, man. Physical. This meant exactly what we expected. Yeah, no even, doubt. Even more so. But but really, we knew that Matt and Nick Jackson both perched on the top. An elbow to Penta. There's another one coming. Maybe look at the Yankee Kid put weight on it, Nick Jackson. And the senton off the top through the table. Oh, no. Kenny Omega Tiger Driver 98 on the barbed wire broom. And it's stuck to his rear end. Man, it's got the broom talent on him. Needs to take care of business here. Phoenix might be out. But there you go. Kenny now covers the far leg hooked to and no! Beat the impact with the common Geary. He just rocked Kenny Omega. Phoenix rolls through went for the cutter. Good counter. Good counter. Oh, the beat trigger. If he can cover him, he's got him. If Kenny can cover him, he's going to get him. Oh, oh he made Joe Kame. Could not get him. One eight. Ring Angel is going to have him. Oh, my God. What a kill. Work on Rana. Two. Yeah, it's nasty right now. 
the Elite really needed that to survive and continue in this series. But the, 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 they won the uh, the battle, the war, I should say, but the battle now is, whew, this is bad. They're going to bust these guys over with us. Oh, good God. Yeah, we know match six in this series will take place next Wednesday night. Dynamite from Denver, Colorado. It will be Falls Count Anywhere. And if necessary, match seven will play, oh, take place on January 11th. It's just a, a lopsided beatdown here, Tony. Uh, it, this is this is what trios competition is all about. I hate to say it, but it's bloody. It's it's brutal, but it's wrapped all about. Yeah, it's very good, and, and especially Shivani in a no disqualification contest like this. And that's what it's going to be like on Friday at our three thousand dollar three kings Christmas casino trios royal match. You were close, Tony. Three hundred thousand dollars, but this I mean. This story is not over. The elite are just completely decimated. But right now, let's take a look at what happened last Wednesday night, immediately following Dynamite. MJF retained the AEW World Championship, but that was not the entire struggle. This is this is unbelievable. Well, let's take a look at this footage from last week. <laughs> 